welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the capricorns this is your season capricorns thank you for being here thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you capricorns please remember if it's your birthday between six if it's your birthday six of january till 12th of january go check out the birthday reading so wow capricorn okay capricorns i see you start the the beginning of the week with heartbreaks okay heartbreaks has been coming up in this week for a lot of people okay so whatever is transpiring don't take it personal so some of you are going to be having heartbreaks with a situation you're trying to uh fight in a strength you have heartbreaks with a situation and you're trying to fight um bring back balance in your life now you're going to be successfully doing that and i see conflicts that some of you are having to do with your boss okay or people in power but i see whoever has used their powers over you people in power and aries Leo, or sagittarius or people in power the tower moment is coming down on them whatever the situation is with people in organization that has used their power the tower moment is coming down i see that some of you are seeing the truth about people in power and i see the truth is coming out but you're going to be successful now there is two form of successful whoever was lying and deceiving in an organization i see a tower moment they're going to be removed out of this organization whatever lies and deceptiveness that was there i see you're dealing with people in power it could be you um this week could be you people in power or a business situation that is transpired but i see the the the, um, the crowning is that negative people is going to be removed away from you and removed away out of the organization let's look at the heartbreak and see what is the heartbreak for the capricorn in the second week of january what is the heartbreak for the capricorn the second week of january okay so wheel of fortune whether it's in the upright or the downright it is the wheel of fortune it's taking you out of hardship in to positives oh, there you go capricorns there you go capis alrighty capis so capis what this is saying is that you felt heartbroken okay you felt heartbroken because of something that has happened and transpired you come in this year and this is why i didn't do any um the first week reading i just received this energy um because i got so much to do i think okay give them the month and i said to you guys that it was the last reading so i don't know i just decided not to do the first week so what is happening here and transpiring here is that um conflicts was in your life this conflicts that was in your life you were right you were right about the situations because i see um it's as if your spirit guides and your angels is guiding you and letting you know something about conflicts i see an offer is going to be coming um up so there is um conflicts with people in power and i see an offer is going to be coming up whatever that has happened and has transpired i see that people are now seeing the truth of uh, the deceptiveness that has played okay a tower moment is here for you capricorns and it has to do with um um it has to do with a situation with a lawyer or some um uh, investigation that was going on is going to come to an end um if you were dealing with a situation with a deceptive lawyer or some deceptive situation that is going to be coming to an end um some of you were dealing with a pisces cancer or scorpion person i see they take down this person it could have been your ex-boss who has done some injustice in the past and i see they take down this person some of you are going to be having an offer from a past love a pisces cancer or a scorpion i see with an investigation some of you um an investigation is here or you are investigating and taking down 
um, some deceptive people and news, good news is coming in. Whatever there was an investigation with a situation, good news is coming in. They have found out what exactly has happened and have transpired, okay? So let's say that your house was broken in, your car was broken in, or something was stolen, they are going to be finding out and you're going to be receiving that news round about Thursday, Friday, okay? Now, an issue and a situation with an organization. Oh my God, bam, 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 Cappy. Changes for rendering. Oh, Cappy, you, you're a double whammy. Uh, it's the first double whammy that has come in. Um, and it, it, this is this is so good for you, Capricorns, because it's the first double whammy that has come in. Bam, bam, bam. You guys are dealing with corporation institutes, your organization. Wow. You guys are really dealing with corporation institutes and organization, especially you men. Um, 45 years and older, you are seeing the truth to a corporation, institutes, organization, whatever that was there and whatever that was transpiring, you're seeing the truth. What I should say in your um, in your foundation, uh, you Capricorns are going to be very successful against a Leo. Whatever the issue is and whatever that was transpiring, you Capricorns are going to be very successful against a Leo because they're going to be finding out that this Leo has do some deceptive things. So yeah, and it's coming to this Leo. This is the transition. An end is coming to a Leo or the end is coming to hardship. Okay, you guys were hardship. You were fighting and trying to balance all things. Your burdens are going to be ending, Capricorns. Okay, this is such a beautiful reading, Cappies. Always come back and look at it when your things are not going well in your week. All right, success is here for you, Capis, and success is here for um, you if you were trying to get pregnant. Um, if your child is in the hospital, you're going to be successful. They're going to be finding a cure for um, this child, whatever that was happening. And I see you are up on a new start moving forward because even though the card is in the reverse, it's looking forward and not backwards, okay? So what a beautiful, beautiful reading. Absolutely, a beautiful reading. All right, so um, what is transpiring, Capricorns, if you have a business, I see your business is going to be making a lot of money, okay? So whatever is transpiring, if your business, um, I see your business is going to be making a lot of money. Um, there is a lot of money that is going to be coming in. Whatever that has been happening and transpiring, I see a lot of money is going to be coming in, especially when it comes on to your business, Cappy. I see a lot of love is happening. I see a lot of you are healing situation with your kids. Um, I see forward movement. I see people who were trying to get pregnant and it was happening. I see that this is definitely going to be happening. I see young men between the age of 18 and 45 that was having some problem in a corporation institute. Say, I see that you're finding out something that was happening in an organization institute. Say, I see that the truth is coming out. Okay. Lies and deception. Um, but you Capricorns are standing strong. Some of you were dealing with a deceptive lawyer or some, and this person is going to be removed out of your life. Some of you and your lawyers uh, or someone could be finding out something about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion. Okay. I see that you're going to be receiving an offer because they found out some deceptiveness with people like bosses or people who have done deceptive situation um where it has to do with uh, they have used their power in the wrong way and i see that he has to do with a gemini a pisces cancer or um a pisces cancer or a scorpio and an aries leo or a sagittarius i see an investigation whatever the investigation is they're going to be taken down your enemies so let's say that your house was broken in or there was some deceptiveness that has transpired i see this all is going to be coming out i see whatever the heartbreaks is 
it's um, a karmatic situation and the wheel of fortune is coming to remove you out of this art breaks and you're going to be victorious and successful i see the transition and uh, um, your burdens is going to be over the end of your burdens a transition is coming in and your burdens is going to be over as we look listen to your intuition listen to your intuition i see a pisces man um i see conflicts with a pisces man i see this man could be offering you something or people in power could be offering you something i see a lot of love that is coming towards um some of you um and um if you have a child and this child was in the hospital or i see people doctors are really working um to help this person the tower moment is here for a pisces cancer or a scorpion whoever this person is and i see a tower moment coming up for an aries Leo or gemini it could be also a lawyer so be careful whatever is transparent people between people between the ages of 18 and 45 you're going to be having issues so it could be people in college people in university whatever because you're going to be seeing and finding out some issues and situation remember that this is a general reading some issues and situation in a corporation i see some of you young people are going to be bringing changes in a corporation or institute so number 555 there's definitely changes coming in because you're taking down lies and deceptiveness tower moment is where some people in power of these their power if your child is sick your child is going to be better if you are pregnant and um you are or oh, you know if you're pregnant and you're having morning sickness and that sort of a thing it's going to be over okay so don't worry about it it's it's definitely going to be over this is looking so positive for you guys whatever is up and then transparent i see um really positive alignment from energies that is going to be coming in for you guys this is just so positive what is coming in for you guys really positive alignment of energies what is going to be coming in for you guys so use the energy that is happening in this week capricorns because it's going to be really wonderful positive alignment of energies okay so i'm trying to get this camera around so you guys can see yeah so um really um fantastic money is going to be coming in i see a whole lot of you are going to be collaborating money is going to be coming in okay so via network collaboration i see a lot of money is going to be coming in so whatever the issue and the situation that there was playing especially if there and financial stability is going to be coming in for the family you can definitely see this so we call on the angels and guys to show us what is going to be coming out for the capricorn why is going to be capricorn this is a beautiful um week if it's your birthday between the six the six of um if it's your birthday between the six of um six of january till 12 of january please all right what do we have here long-term stability all right so some of you had some heartbreaks over an issue or a situation where something could have stolen something that could have given you long-term stability whatever that heartbreaks was over something in the past that was stolen that would have given you long-term stability this is being a return to you okay so there was some deceptive situation whatever whether it was a car um it, it's coming up as a car that some of you, your car was stolen or something that was stolen it could be a house something that was stolen that but that thing could give you long-term stability it could also be a, a business idea or a business that was stolen i see um it's going to be return now i see um uh, the energy with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius or this could be a lawyer I see a new start is going to be coming in um, if there was issue with children because I see a lot of children some of you Capricorns have an issue with children in this week a lot of issue coming up with children I see they're going to be released and coming out of a situation I see conflicts between um, conflicts is coming up between you 
um, young um, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn um, in your company, organization, institute, say, um, there is conflicts. However, you got involved um, in a situation, especially on um, there's a lot of meetings you have been called. It's like you have been called to, uh, they found out a situation that you are connected to. So remember, this is just a general read and take what serves you and leave the rest. But some of you young people between 18 and 45, I see huge conflicts in um, corporation institutes. And I think you're going to be making some changes Whatever this conflicts is, I think you're going to be making some changes, but there is conflicts um, in organization institutes, say, okay? I see some of you are going to be receiving some news from overseas emotional news. It could be news of a new offer, a new contract that is going to be given to you. They have seen what has happened and what has transpired. There is also, ooh, news is coming about um, networking, cooperation, working together. I see financial stability that is going to be coming in. Um, and I see good news is coming in. So wonderful, positive alignment of energies that is happening and just is transpiring. I love you, Car Car Ken, uh, Capricorn, so much. All right. Woo, Capricorns. Ooh, Capis. Capis. So number five, 55 is going to be your energy vibration. But this week has so many wonderful success, um, Capricorns, because you have the Wheel of Fortune. You have um, the chariot. So if your car, I see some of you could be buying your dream car that you wanted all this time. I see you're definitely going to be buying your dream car. The, and this car you're going to be having for a very long time. It could be a sports car. I see you're, some of you could have had a sports car too that you were um, having and they, you know, your car was stolen or whatever, but I see a resolution. But whoever has stolen something from you and whoever has used their power, I see that this is going to be resolved. Intuition Insight, number 18. Okay, Intuition Insights. So, your intuitive abilities are very accurate right now. So you can trust your guidance to lead you in the right direction. Follow your own insight over the advice of others and don't allow fear or worries to guide your way. It may be the best to keep your secrets to yourself right now. So whatever is happening, whatever you decide to do, Capricorns, don't tell anyone your secret in this timeline. Let it go, okay? Follow your dreams. So some of you Capricorns have been wondering and asking yourself what it is I should do. Should I go back in corporate world? Should I continue with what I'm doing? They're saying, follow your dreams. If you Capricorn had a dream and you have always been dreaming and open, they're saying, follow your dreams. So it's going to be a very intuitive, insightful week. And uh, this is wonderful because what is going to be happening is that you are going to be following your dreams. Call down on Archangel Metatron in this week, um, Capricorns. Um, ask the pure white light to flow through you and surround you. Um, follow um, with your heart, okay? So follow your dreams, Capricorn. Meditate on your heart's desire. Rearrange your schedule so that you are spending time in ways that are truly meaningful to you. Okay? So wh whatever it is, if it's like focusing at work to finish off things and start preparing for things, just stay focused and meditate in this week. Okay? And the affirmation for you Capricorns is that I deserve the best. I deserve the best. This is the affirmation for you Capricorn in this week. I deserve the best. Okay. I deserve the best. I take charge of my schedule and my life. So in this week, um, Capricorns, um, you're use this affirmation. I deserve the best. I take charge of my schedule and my life. I deserve the best. 
I take charge of my schedule and my life. I love you, Capricorns. Whatever is happening in this week, know that you're going to be okay. I am saying namaste and I'm out.